How's it going everybody? Welcome to Sick Eric Tech. Today we're going to be doing a fun video. We're going to see who's got the fastest in-display fingerprint sensor in town. We got the Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra with this ultrasonic fingerprint sensor. We got the OnePlus 10 Pro with this optical fingerprint sensor. The Google Pixel 6, again, optical in-display fingerprint sensor. And the LG Wing with an optical in-display fingerprint sensor. I was going to use my LG V60, but it does have a screen protector on there and I wanted to keep it off there. None of these devices have screen protectors. So as far as which one is the fastest one, we're gonna find out in this quick dumb video today, we're gonna unlock each device about five to 10 times and see exactly how fast it is. So everybody says that the Samsung has the fastest uh, in display fingerprint sensor, which is an um, not an optical, but it is an ultrasonic, which means that it is faster. It does not need the light to read your finger, uh, it uses sound waves while everything else uses a light. And as far as always on display goes, the Samsung has it right there on the always on display. The OnePlus, you sort of got to tap on it in order to bring it up, it'll have it up for a little bit. The Google Pixel has the icon there always, and the LG will pop up once you pick up your phone or touch it right there. So I think that the ease of accessing the fingerprint sensor would probably go to the Samsung. So let's go ahead and start off with that one. So we're gonna unlock it uh, several times and try not to have my face catch it because it does have face ID. So we are barely tapping on the fingerprint sensor and it is unlocking three, four, five. Let's go ahead and turn the screen on. It's trying to read the face. Six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. So as you can see, very, very fast. You don't even have to set your fingerprint on there. All you gotta do is just tap it and boom. It's so quick that it unlocks it. Now let's go on to the OnePlus. Now OnePlus used to have really good in-display fingerprint sensors. And uh, let's go ahead and see how that does. So we're tapping on it. That's one, two, three, four, so we got to sort of set the finger on there just a little bit longer than the Samsung. You can't just tap it like you did on the uh, Samsung like so. You sort of got to set it on there a little bit. Now it's going on wonky. There we go. So there you go as far as speed goes. And the OnePlus is snappier. It is fast, but not as fast as the Samsung. As you can see right there, trying to just tap the finger on there. Ain't gonna cut it for the OnePlus 10 Pro. Well, on the Samsung, very, very nice and easy. Now let's go on over to the Google Pixel 6. Now the Google Pixel 6 has been known to have issues and has gotten a lot better over software updates. So you still gotta set your finger on there just for a little bit longer for it to unlock. You can't just tap it like so. You gotta set it on there just for a little bit just to unlock the device and for it to read. You can't tap like you can on the Samsung or else it won't read it. There we go. You gotta set your finger on there for a little bit. And there is the uh, Google Pixel 6 optical in display fingerprint sensor now let's go on over to lg with the lg wing so there's one now the lg wing just as fast as the google now as far as just tapping on it you can't unlock it just by tapping you got to set your finger on there and uh, it seems a little bit more snappier than the uh, pixel so that is pretty cool that LG 
actually does it pretty well. Now the uh, Pixel and the LG Wing do not have Face ID or Face Unlock. The Galaxy and the OnePlus do have Face Unlock. And there we go with the LG Wing. So as far as speediness goes, I think the LG Wing beats out the uh, Google Pixel 6 as far as having that little bit quicker in display fingerprint sensor. Uh, of course the winner here is probably and obviously going to be the Galaxy S22 Ultra. OnePlus uh, it definitely has gone down over the years. I remember their fingerprints used to be pretty quick and they still are but uh, every now and then you do get a little bit of misreads on there for the OnePlus which is probably software related. I know OnePlus devices have been kind of iffy lately but uh, probably the fastest will probably be the Galaxy S22 Ultra, OnePlus, and then the Wing, and then the Google Pixel 6 coming in at last. So Samsung has the best fingerprint sensor in the market. It looks like they are holding it with their ultrasonic fingerprint sensor on their Galaxy devices. OnePlus is still coming in with their optical in-display fingerprint sensors. LG not doing so bad, and I think the Pixel has come a long way and has gotten a lot better, but still very slow compared to other devices out there. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you appreciate this video. If you found it fun and useful, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down, and I will see you next time. Peace.